Now, this is IBM's next generation client center, which offers hands on access to advanced technologies. It's one of 41 centers across 33 countries. And here to tell us more about the South African client center is Abe Thomas, the country manager for IBM South Africa. Abe, welcome. Hi, thanks, Natasha. Now, historically, this was actually the first innovation center on the continent before it became the client center. And you also have innovation centers in Nairobi. You're also planning one in Lagos and uh, Casablanca in Morocco. That's right. What's the difference between the client center and the innovation center? And what do you offer your clients right here? Well, the uh, Africa Innovation Center, which we set up a couple of years ago, has uh, evolved to the client center that we have today. The main difference uh, between the two centers is the ability for clients to today access technologies that are going to make a big difference for them in the future. And most of the uh, technologies that we want to exhibit and help our clients uh, do hands-on uh, proof of concepts or proof of technologies on revolve around uh, the smarter planet uh, solutions, uh, cloud, uh, analytics, mobility, as well as uh, the uh, social, uh, social sphere. So that's the main difference. You know, the uh, technologies that we are showcasing here really revolve around the technologies that clients need today to help transform their businesses and their processes. Now your clients, although the technology is similar, client needs differ from country to country and continent to continent. How important is Africa-grown innovation? Well, if you look at the African continent, if you look at uh, the uh, incidence of uh, mobile phones here, uh, that is a clear indication that there is a need for companies and organizations in the African continent to engage with their constituents, be it the clients or the citizens, in a different way. And given the uh, rampant use of uh, mobile technology, what better way than to provide capability for organizations, both private and public sector, to engage with uh, their constituents through the mobile phone. And uh, those technologies that allow you to do that are the kinds of technologies that we are showcasing in the center here. And we are allowing our clients and partners to come in here, test drive these solutions, capabilities to build the right solutions for the organization. Because that's going to be my next question. Practically speaking, what happens when a client enters, sits with the IBM team and starts collaborating and work, working and showcasing these technologies? Well, it, it starts with first understanding what they want to do. Uh, and let's is, say I'm a bank. Right, so if you're a bank and let's say you are interested in an uh, analytics solution, so we obviously need to understand what it is that you already have because most of the data uh, that a bank has sits on what we call systems of record. Right? So these are systems that are legacy systems that we have today in organizations. In order for these data, for the data that is residing here to be presented in a way that takes advantage of these technologies, we need to understand what it is that the client wants to do and using the technologies that we have, try and build a proof of concept and or demonstrate a proof of technology on how we can work with the systems that they have. We're not trying to tell the client to throw away everything that they have. It is really to leverage the investment they've already made, but make it uh, more modern and more approachable for them to interact with their clients. And more practical. And more practical for them as well. Now, Abe, uh, IBM made a very important announcement this week about a new cloud Linux capability. How's that going to work? We just launched yesterday a uh, mainframe cloud and Linux uh, capability in the center as well. Uh, we see the mainframe, which is in its 50th year of existence. And that was one platform that people had written off. But clients continue to invest in the mainframe and we're bringing more capability to the mainframe for our clients to be able to use the mainframe to get into the new era of solutions, which I just talked about. So we're going to use Linux, we're going to use uh, the cloud capability of the mainframe to drive analytic solutions, uh, mobile solutions, or social uh, solutions that uh, we are trying to showcase uh, in South Africa. Well, Abe, hopefully in the future we can come take a look at those capabilities. Thank you very much. You're more than welcome. Thank you.